Well, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am Nick here with Ryan and Ty. What up? We did Faith No More because I was wearing a Faith No More t shirt, and that first video was Dio. So I was like, hey, we should probably just do Dio again. <laughs> <laughs> so in that video, Ty asked me a question. You said, who came first, Dio or Iron Maiden? And I said, Iron Maiden. And people were like, whoa, 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 you dummy. Dio was out first. Here's the thing, guys. I was talking about Dio the band, yeah. not the man himself. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so that got lost in translation. You know, there was a ton of people like saying how wrong I was. I wasn't wrong. You guys just heard the wrong thing. I just meant Dio the band. We know Dio is a legend. Yes. He's one of the godfathers of metal. So the first time we did Holy Diver, uh, which is a metal classic. Yeah, that was a good one. Uh, fantastic song. And the solo in that uh, really is far. E even Ryan had a reaction <laughs> to that solo. <laughs> but I thought that we'd hit a different album and do a song that uh, I haven't heard before. Ooh. It'll be none of us have heard before. That's right. No, I've never heard of Dio until nope. Holy Diver. Nope. Uh, so this song is called We Rock. Pretty straightforward. We do rock. <laughs> <laughs> just in my head already, I'm, I'm just thinking it's going to sound like, you know, Dio. You know his voice. We rock. Yeah. You know, that's just how I'm thinking it's going to sound. I'm just thinking, like I want to rock. <laughs> Twisted <laughs> Sister. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Dio said this was quickly written at Caribou Studios at 12,000 feet in the Colorado Rockies, where we spent three months recording the album. It took us a month just to figure out how to breathe. We were so high. It was a very spiritual place. The snow, trees, and elk running around outside our door. We were playing pool one afternoon, and I said, we rock because that's what we do. Voila, another anthem. <laughs> <laughs> so he knew in his head at that moment. He's like, oh, we rock. So let's name that song because it's very important to let you guys know we rock. that we do, in fact, rock. And by the way, like I would just love to be in a snowy cabin. One day, I just want my own cabin in the middle of nowhere and I want it to snow. Rush, Tom Sawyer. Yeah, that place. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is from the second album, The Last in Line, released in 1984. It is the opener, and the album did go platinum. And I just want to say that the album cover, it reminds me of Night on Bald Mountain, and that's in the Disney movie Fantasia. Yes, it does look like it. Great skit. Yeah, it is. It's yeah. Fantasia is one of the best movies of all time. For sure. So it makes me love that album cover. Just for that reason. <laughs> Let's do it. Back to Dio. This is Dio. We rock. Oh, that bass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Going hard on that snare. Man, the intensity from the start. And then they go kind of like in the more uh, traditional metal type of groove. Yeah, but this does rock. This is playlist already. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm adding it. And I feel like the only reason you can say, because we rock, we rock, we you rock. You have to rock. Exactly. You better like, not not rock. If it's not Dio, that probably doesn't work. Yeah. <laughs> but when you have somebody that's such like... Uh, 
an icon in metal. Such a powerful voice for such a small guy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> How did that come out of him? When he was a baby, did he just like, you know, his first words were just, mother? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, he just went from mom straight he to mother? He was just masculine from the start, you mm. know what I'm saying? Anytime I kind of hear metal that's in this thrash metal zone. <laughs> yeah, it just has, just has the get and go with yeah. it. That's probably my favorite. When it comes to metal. Me like too. That, that yeah. version. Just takes you on a ride. Yeah. And when you pair that with great vocals. Yes. I mean, that's just icing on the cake. Yes. You know, again, with metal, vocals, or whatever. You know, it's it's just the added bonus. His vocals are good, though. Yeah, his is good. Oh, no. They're excellent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they're excellent. Now, running back, though, this is... Uh, I, I agree. I agree that it's already playlist. And this uh, demon is just staring right through me. He's like, it, it better be playlist. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Snare. This song is getting it. The accents are great. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He get the. Yeah, I gotta look up the drummer because I don't know who this man is, but uh, he is he destroying the song. Yeah. He was double tapping somewhere right there. Yeah. And it's through the verses, too. I mean, yeah. it's, it's this entire song. He's just getting after everything yes. on his, the kid. He's getting his money made for this song. <laughs> oh, yeah. Man, Vinny Abbasi. He is. Murdering this song. <laughs> Again, that's Vivian Campbell on guitar, right? He was the one that ended up being uh, in Def Leppard later in his career, and people were like, he wasn't the same after that. Well, that's a completely well, different band. Yeah, so. he, well, yeah. I mean, he wasn't doing metal music. <laughs> right. But, uh, but Probably light work to him. You know, oh, yeah. He, go over there he rips on guitar. Maybe he just wanted to do that, though. Yeah. Take a break. You know, you never know. He didn't like, want to shred anymore. Just kind of wanted to... Chill yeah. out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Y'all know my legacy. My name. That's right. Vivian. That's all you got to say. Yeah, it's, I mean, Dirk Nowitzki won only one ring, but everybody remembers that ring, though. It's like, yeah, Vivian Campbell might have had a short stint in D.O., but man, listen to how he played. You know, that's what people will remember him most for. This is really an excellent song. <laughs> You called that chair. Yeah. <laughs> I 
Yes. Yeah. I love how he said, that's rock. <laughs> Thanks for letting us know, Ronnie. That uh, title lives up to the hype. I mean, it's it's nothing that we haven't heard. You know, we've heard all types of metal that sound similar to that, but uh, that's not a bad thing. It may be something that uh, we're used to hearing in this genre. doesn't mean we can't like it. Our uh, fondness of it came from somewhere. And this is certainly... Uh, one of the albums that uh, our love stemmed from, for sure. That was Playlist, and I really thought that Vinny shined in that song, man. For this type of song, I just really think he made it better. Even if he was average on this, it would have been good, but I really think it was his uh, feels and everything that he was doing that uh, really took this over the top. So is the guy on the cover on all of their covers? Kind of how... The guy on Iron Maiden. Yeah, I'm not sure. You, you know, because he is on the other cover of the one that we did the first time, so... He might be. Just saying. He might A be. A lot of similarities between Dio and Iron Maiden. That's just my opinion. Yeah. That's why I said something about it the last time, is they just really remind me uh, very similar. It has the gallop. Yeah, so... It has the gallop, for and, sure. And I, and I love it, so <laughs> I'm down. <laughs> yeah, for me, this song is a playlist. I like this a lot, actually. I just like the the fast. Even on the solo, I like how they, he was even doing a solo kind of fast. Too. He's kind of keeping with the the sound that they were giving off in the right. beginning. Because he could have slowed it down, you know, did some crazy stuff, like, you know, some crazy stuff. But I mean, I like how he just kept with it, kind of did his own little thing. And uh, I think it's phenomenal. I think it's a great song. You know, sometimes it does kind of go along with We Rock. It's <laughs> We Rock. Yeah. I did call the chant. I knew it was going to be a chant song. Yeah, it was only once, though. They're going to be singing, oh, yeah. we rock the whole yeah. time, easily. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's true. You, you can just break that part down. <laughs> Everybody, come on, yeah, come right. on. <laughs> we rock. Yeah, 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 right. That's just one of those metal songs where it's like, uh, even if you don't like metal, I feel like you can like that one. You, you can have a great time with that one. You know, a lot of people that really don't like this genre, a big part of it is because they're like, I don't like the vocals. You know what I'm saying? Because, mm-hmm. you know, that, that really does matter to people. But Ronnie James Dio, he's just one of those special ones where it's like he's just got one of the God voices <laughs> somehow, some way. He influenced uh, so many people, so many people, uh, and not only in this genre, like that you can hear the influence in other genres as well. Yeah, I'll give us more Dio request. That one was a banger. I'm going to play that one a lot. That's right. That's it, guys. Don't forget to drop a like. And as always, please tell us your views. Thanks for subscribing and hitting that bell. Peace Peace out. out.